down now that I'm thinking about it, you know? <laughs> so you're the historian? I, I mean, I guess... Well, sell me of on it. what? Yes, become the Matthew McConaughey of <laughs> K-pop storytelling. Okay. Right. I'm I guess listening. that's my goal. I guess we could start with my latest Jinju snaps. I'm just coming along to say that I'm NCT trash. I'm standing in a room where there's nothing but things they made and I'm trying not to cry. This is a set of lockers with all their costumes and I'm gonna burst. It physically hurts. It's all they videos from when they auditioned to turn into training ducks. I'm so happy that they're getting some shine. They're so magic. It makes me feel like I'm five. I don't know what else to say man I'm NCT trash okay so now I've like I've lightweight gotten myself together now but like where I am is in the the SM museum but the thing that's so spectacular is aside from just literally these are all the costumes from black on black I physically am incapable as hey Chan hey all oh, my camera shaking um <laughs> This don't make no sense. This don't make no sense. Look at you talk. Popeye's biscuit thick Johnny. Okay, so um the thing that I really was trying to like get before I had a freaking meltdown, the room shows the blueprint, if you will, of how you went from concept of a whole bunch of young men to an actual living breathing. God in heaven, um an actual living breathing 18 unit group. Like this is if I had the time, which I will, I will make time to be in here from open to close one day. I just want to take extensive notes so that I can do a solid presentation on them for the YouTube channel because this is just this is just not enough. Um, hey, Chan. Oh uh, God. Uh, tail. Okay. Um, yeah, it's just it's it's everything down to like marketing materials that were utilized, handwritten notes about how the producing and production experience has been. I am trying to keep this camera from shaking because yes, okay, I am a fan of the guys, I, I am, but I'm a fan of a lot of EXO, uh, not EXO, <laughs> it said EXO Planet, that's why. I'm a fan of a lot of artists from SM, but I am very much blown away by the process of how a group this large just came to be. You're looking at stuff of like, prior to their debut and just how chicken mcnugget young they were and still are it's just it's absolutely incredible to be able to see so much of how everything transitioned this is an absolute bar none public acknowledgement to the fact that the motown formula works because this this is it this is absolutely it in every fiber of its existence and this was the original setup with 2008, having Johnny as the first member and also the oldest. Um, look at those transitions. Isn't that shocking? It's absolutely dope. At one point in time, he used to look like that. It's all a lie. Look at Tainty Tiny Mark. Okay, so yeah, I'm going to do some, some serious work on this. This will be for the YouTube channel next year. But lo and behold, my illustrious, magical, magical NCT dreams come true. Let's go.